In the heart of a dense, foreboding forest stood an ancient, gnarled tree, its roots twisting deep into the earth. Surrounding this tree was an aura of mystery, whispered about by villagers for generations. Legend spoke of a deep, dark well hidden within the tangled undergrowth, a place where the veil between worlds grew thin and where the creatures of nightmares roamed. One crisp autumn day, a group of adventurous children from the nearby village decided to explore the forest. Among them was Sarah, a fearless girl with fiery red hair and an insatiable curiosity. As they ventured deeper into the woods, the air grew thick with a sense of foreboding, but Sarah's excitement only grew. After hours of trudging through the underbrush, they stumbled upon the ancient tree, its branches twisted and contorted like the fingers of a witch. At its base lay the entrance to the well, hidden beneath a thick layer of moss and fallen leaves. Eager to uncover its secrets, the children cleared away the debris and revealed a crumbling staircase leading down into the darkness below. Without hesitation, Sarah led the way, her friends following closely behind. The descent seemed endless, the only sound echoing in the narrow confines of the staircase was the soft drip of water seeping through the ancient stone walls. As they descended further into the depths, the air grew colder, sending shivers down their spines. Finally, they reached the bottom and emerged into a cavernous chamber, illuminated only by the faint glow of luminescent fungi clinging to the walls. The air was thick with the scent of damp earth and decay, and the children's excitement waned as a sense of unease settled over them. Suddenly, a rustling sound echoed through the darkness, causing the children to freeze in terror. From the shadows emerged a group of grotesque figures, their twisted forms illuminated by the dim light. They were gnomes, but unlike any the children had ever seen before. Their skin was pallid and mottled, their eyes gleaming with hunger as they advanced towards the terrified children. With a shriek of terror, Sarah turned and fled, her friends close on her heels. But the gnomes were relentless, their unearthly shrieks echoing through the cavern as they pursued the children through the labyrinth and tunnels. As they ran, the children stumbled upon a chamber filled with bones, the remnants of countless victims who had met their grisly fate at the hands of the gnomes. Realization dawned on them. They were not the first to stumble upon this cursed place, nor would they be the last. With nowhere left to run, the children found themselves cornered, the gnomes closing in on them with ravenous hunger in their eyes. As the creatures lunged forward, their gnarled hands reaching out to snatch their prey, the darkness engulfed them, leaving nothing behind but the echo of terrified screams. And so, deep within the heart of the forest, the well remained, its secrets hidden from the world above. And though the villagers whispered tales of the children who disappeared into the depths of the forest, none dared to venture near the ancient tree, lest they too fall prey to the gnomes who dwelled within. Deep within the shadows of the forest, a lone figure watched the events unfold with a sinister grin. This figure was none other than the Witch of the Woods, a powerful sorceress who had long been rumored to consort with dark forces. From her hidden lair, she had ensnared the minds of the gnomes, twisting them to her will and using them as her unwitting minions. As the children met their fate at the hands of the gnomes, the Witch of the Woods cackled with delight, reveling in the fear and despair that permeated the air. For centuries, she had fed off the suffering of those foolish enough to wander into her domain, and now, she had claimed a new batch of victims to sate her insatiable hunger. But even as the echoes of their screams faded into the darkness, a glimmer of hope remained. Deep within the heart of the forest, a brave adventurer had heard tales of the cursed well and vowed to uncover its secrets. Armed with knowledge and courage, they set out on a quest to confront the darkness that lurked within. Through treacherous terrain and myriad perils, the adventurer pressed on, guided by a determination to banish the evil that had taken root in the forest. With each step closer to the well, the air grew heavier with malevolence, but the adventurer pressed on undeterred. Finally, they stood before the ancient tree, its twisted branches reaching out like skeletal fingers towards the heavens. With a deep breath, the adventurer descended into the depths of the well, prepared to face whatever horrors awaited them below. As they navigated the winding tunnels and evaded the traps set by the Witch of the Woods, the adventurer's resolve remained unshaken. With cunning and bravery, they outwitted the gnomes and finally stood face to face with the sorceress herself. In a clash of magic and willpower, the adventurer fought valiantly against the Witch of the Woods, their determination to protect the innocent outweighing the darkness that threatened to consume them. With a final burst of energy, they unleashed a powerful spell that banished the witch back into the depths of the forest, sealing the well and putting an end to the terror that had plagued the land for centuries. As the dawn broke over the horizon, the forest seemed to sigh with relief, the shadows receding as the light of a new day brought hope and renewal. And though the memory of the children who had been lost to the forest would never be forgotten, the darkness that had once held sway had been vanquished, 
Thanks to the bravery of one lone adventurer who dared to confront the deepest, darkest secrets of the forest. As the adventurer emerged from the depths of the forest, they were greeted by the warm embrace of sunlight filtering through the canopy above. The villagers, who had long feared the cursed well and the creatures that dwelled within, gathered around them, their faces filled with awe and gratitude. Word of the adventurer's bravery spread like wildfire throughout the land, and they were hailed as a hero, their name spoken in reverent whispers by those who had once cowered in fear. With the threat of the Witch of the Woods vanquished, the forest flourished once more, its ancient trees standing tall and proud as if rejoicing in their newfound freedom. In the years that followed, the children of the village grew up hearing tales of the courageous adventurer who had saved them from certain doom. They played in the forest without fear, knowing that the darkness that had once lurked within its depths had been banished forever. And though the memory of the well and the gnomes who dwelled within faded into legend, a small part of the forest remained forever haunted by the echoes of the past. But even in the darkest corners, where the shadows lingered and the trees whispered of long-forgotten secrets, there was now a glimmer of hope, a reminder that even in the face of unimaginable darkness, the light of bravery and courage would always prevail. Like, subscribe, and click on notifications that will allow you to stay up to date with the news and not miss videos from the channel, where there will be many more horror stories.